I think the, the new technologies, all these tools, I think they are a tool only. And I think at the end of the day, how can they impact our life in a positive way? And what we have been doing as the uh, ICT for Peace Foundation uh, is to look how can we use these tools uh, in, a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a sequence, in a scenario where we don't have peace and where these tools can be used, for instance, for early warning, prevention, mediation, post-conflict reconstruction, and peace building. So um, we look at it, how can uh, these tools help the international community, especially if she is, if the international community is working in a multi-stakeholder context. So you have different groups, different people, and where all these new tools, of course, come very handy. Uh, if we look uh, how they can be used, for instance, if we are in a, in a crisis, uh, man-made or natural, and I think there are a lot of uh, relationship to, to what we're discussing today. And uh, what we found is that, uh, of course, these tools are not being used sufficiently yet, uh, especially if we look in a formal uh, sense of missions with where you have military, where you have uh, NGOs, bilateral donors, and so forth, who move into a mission, being a peacekeeping plus crises, other crises, and so forth. But I think that's, uh, I think, very important, where we could probably see uh, a practical uh, use of, of these tools. Now, of course, we have to, as it was said before, the credibility questions comes in when we look at the tools. But just to give another a few examples, huh? for instance, there was um, a message, SMS, by somebody in Sudan who was a victim and they were expecting food supplies. He could send an SMS to an international organization which is dealing with food and could say, you know, things are not arriving. These are the tools that are um, being used. For instance, Wikipedia was used in, in, in Mumbai during the, in 24 hours. 24 hours, over 400 uh, notes were sent and corrected. So even, you know, you were referring to the self-correction, the, the improvement of quality. This is uh, the, the second uh, example. I mean, you mentioned the, the, the Google Maps on Darfur with the Holocaust Museum. Did. So it's not. But I think we still have to weigh their opportunities of these tools. And when we look now, let's say, move into a mission in a, in a situation, in a country, the international community, with all these stakeholders, we have these new tools now, they are there. The young aid workers, when we talk about uh, these uh, humanitarian aid workers, they have them, they use them. Some organizations don't, they still go with maps. And second, what you're referring to is the media. I mean, the media is there also, the national, international, and third, as a source of information, if you have to make critical decisions in a crisis, of course, we have the UN, the sit situation reports, and so forth. So I think we have to look at all these, these tools that are out there uh, with their opportunities. Now, how could we combine this? Um, let me finish with the last uh, example that we're working on. You probably have heard about uh, Ushahidi. Ushahidi, who is a crowdsourcing, huh? that's a new, new word, has been active in Kenya after the elections where people could send by SMS messages on events. Huh? And they send it and it can be visualized on, on, the, on the maps immediately. Uh, and that has been then used also in Gaza and other, other places. Now, what we are trying to do with Ushahidi, we have contacted them, is to bring in a kind of a, a qualifier on the information. For instance, uh, we're trying to have a little matrix where we could say the, the, the person who sends the message says, you know, I, I, I saw it, but it was blurred, or I, I have it hearsay, or my brother told it, or it's unreliable resource. So that we're building, bringing in the, the question or correctivity, correct the credibility question by developing the new tools while we, on these websites, which can be visualized, you can also go back to the person who sent it, say, can you check again? Uh, we can also bring the traditional media on these screens. Plus, and you can send these messages by SMS with Twitter and, and others. Uh, we are working just for your information uh, with the, uh, the United Nations in New York uh, on, in general, improved crisis information management within the UN family. 